hello uh here's just a quick one i guess if you're if you're doing your assemblies and you have some issues like if i come across something like this in an assembly right and um take a look at it and we could see we've got holes everywhere so this is obviously a user error I have extra holes on this angle a 29 so what I do is generally I'll go back here and have a look and I'll come into my model browser and I'll go to a 29 that is this one over here this should be one of a kind so if I renumber there shouldn't be an issue I don't think this is going to be the same size this was a smaller space so my distance here is six inches yeah so this should be one of a kind so it should just update this drawing the issue you might have is if you have a mistake like this that you should really renumber so if I select those holes the point would be to renumber now if I renumber this and it's the same as another one this number will change, so it will want to delete this drawing, or the other drawing, uh, I'm not sure which. So that shouldn't be the case with mine. So what I'm going to do is just number, and you can see my A6 has changed to an A12. So, so delete duplicate drawings, yes. So we can see down here that the A6 has been deleted. So before I used to get frustrated with these things, but you gotta just move on. I mean, if I didn't renumber, I would have issues with my lists and everything. So it's good practice to renumber. So the A6 is the only one. So it has been deleted. Now, if I go into the project folder for this, uh, let's see details you can see the a6 has been deleted there's only the backup file is there so that has been deleted so you don't need to worry when you're doing your lists later or anything it will be gone so now let me go back here this has not been updated so first of all uh, the weight probably won't change so go to update list so that stayed the same. If you're inside in the drawing, you need to update the list and update the detail. And you can see now that is fixed. So a lot of times it's good practice to do your assemblies first and then just clean up your drawings. So I thought that might help. Uh, these are things I guess I didn't really know how to do at the start. So right now my number is up to date and this piece is fixed and then move on to the next one. All right. Hope that helps. Thanks. Bye.